residing in Canada has made a donation of supplies to the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice, Local Government and Empowerment for distribution to citizens adversely affected by the economic fallout of COVID-19. More in this report. Founded in Canada by St. Lucia Naomi Thomas Jules, Girls United Foundation, GUF, is committed to advancing the well-being of girls and women. Initially an organization concerned with the struggles of women afflicted with sickle cell anemia, Naomi, conscious of the plight that COVID-19 has brought to men in St. Lucia, marshaled resources and launched a chapter in her home community of Miku. Nintas Magre is the president. The vision is to assist in enriching women and girls in education, health, professional development, and mentorship, including leadership skills. They also provide scholarships, tutoring, mentorship programs. Some of the um, projects involve the backpack and laptop drive, computer labs projects, advocacy for women and girls, family support groups, housing referrals, mental health workshops, healthy eating, nutrition training, employment readiness, and financial literacy. Girls United is broadening its reach by including all who are in need. The foundation recently presented a variety of materials to the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice, Local Government, and Empowerment. Permanent Secretary Velda Joseph says the ministry works with a number of target groups and in the last six months, there has been a steady rise in the number of people seeking assistance. From accommodation needs to housing, to food, um, to educational, it's a wide range of needs. And I've often said to people when they say to us, look at the resources that you have and see what you can do. I said, are you asking persons to choose between food and housing? That is difficult because these are basic needs that persons require. These are things that we need to assist persons in achieving. And so when we see the efforts of partners such as Girls United Foundation, we are very, very pleased that you have taken on the mantle, you have recognized the need, and you have gone out there trying to source assistance and receiving that type of assistance on behalf of persons who need. I am sure these persons will be highly appreciated as we are for the generous donation that they, they will be receiving. The supplies were gained through a virtual COVID-19 fundraiser hosted by the Foundation. Deputy Director of Social Transformation in the Ministry of Equity, Jim Zavi, assured that the distribution would be equitable. I want to thank profusely the Girls United Foundation. As PS indicated, we are inundated with requests, variety of requests for food items, for clothing, for educational supplies. And as you know, government doesn't have the resources to supply everyone. And so we are very happy when organizations, NGOs can come forward and make that contribution. It goes a long way. We want to give it a commitment that the items will be fairly distributed, equitably distributed, because we've heard I um, mean, elsewhere that items were received and they did not go to the persons who needed them the most. But we are going to ensure that your efforts are going to be well rewarded and that the persons who are going to receive the items are going to be most deserving of it. Founder of Girls United Foundation, Naomi thomas Jules addressed the ceremony virtually from Canada and pledged continued assistance to her homeland. From the Government Information Service, Lisa Joseph reports in.